Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to update the firmware on the Nikon Z8. And in case you're wondering, once you do the update it actually keeps your presets so you don't have to worry about exporting them. And all the links are in the description. Let's go. To check your current firmware version, click on Menu and then click on the spanner to get into the settings. And you want to be down on the bottom so you can scroll around to get it. Click on Firmware Version. And as you see here, we're on Firmware Version 2.00. Press Done. Eject the CF Express card from the Z8. Close the cover, place it into your CF Express reader. If you've had the firmware update email from Nikon, just go into the download center, click on that, and then just choose your operating system. For me, it's going to be Mac OS. It will tell you what's new. So if you want to read about what's new, it's all up there. Accept the terms and conditions, press download, and files about 92 meg. Open your downloads folder and open your CF Express drive. And what we want to do so you want to make sure that we copy this file, the bin file, into the root directory so it's above all these folders. And this contains the firmware file that we need. And then just eject the drive. Open the cover and put the CF Express card back in the Z8. Close the cover. Power on the Z8. Go to menu. Go to the spanner. And then scroll down to firmware version. And then you'll see an option which says update. Press the update. And then he says it's going from 2 to 2.01. Press OK and then press the middle button. And then wait for ages. It probably takes about five minutes. Once the update is completed, turn the camera off. And then I power it up and we're going to remove the firmware file. To do this, go into menu, click on the spanner, go to firmware, and then select delete firmware update files. Camera body. Yes. And then press OK. And that's going to remove it from the memory card. And we're done. We're on the new firmware version. And you should also be able to see that if you go into the My menu, that all of your presets that you had before are there. If you found this helpful, leave a comment below. Hit that like button and smash that subscribe. And well, if you didn't like it, hit that dislike twice. And thanks for watching.